Houting education officials visiting Glovo's school in search of answers regarding his death. The learner's family alleges that another metric boy gave him poison in the school's toilet in what they believe to have been an act of bullying. The department's preliminary report, however, indicates that there were no reports of bullying involving the deceased and the school's security cameras found no evidence of the alleged incident. Your, your question was, um, there was Brian um, unwell on, on any of our CCTV footage. Um, no, he was not. And the reports that I got from the three teachers that taught him after break um, also doesn't indicate that. The report that I got from Mr. Zorbo, the teacher who dropped him off at <coughs> home, um, doesn't indicate that. He cracked a joke with his friends and said to Mr. Zorbo, um, Sir, I will see you tomorrow. The deceased family indicated that he complained of a stomach ache in the evening and was rushed to a local medical facility, but he was certified dead at the facility. Only incident that took place in the school that the school was able to record was an incident where the deceased Brian had a scuffle with a grade 8. Uh, Brian was a grade 9 learner with a grade 8 and the incident was seen uh, where Brian did slap the grade 8. Um, the, 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 the teacher at the school, I believe is Mr. Lombard, correct, witnessed the whole incident, were able to take the learners into the to meet with the deputy principal so that they can handle the issue. Chilani says the deceased reportedly had an altercation with a grade 8 learner earlier on the day he died, which resulted in him being physical towards the learner. So because this, this uh, incident has also got an element of suspicion, the police are also part. The school has cooperated fully from day one, uh, giving them the full access to the footages the camera, the, the videos, uh, has, has given in their statement, the principal has given the statement of, on behalf of the school. Uh, the district has been here from day one. Um, so that is on the level of police. The police are still investigating, we are still waiting for the post-mortem of what happened to, to the learner. Chilani says the department has launched a school safety campaign called Operation Kutamulao, which will assist in taking the necessary disciplinary steps against bullying in schools. Mulimone Mutese BC News, Johannesburg.